The 60th anniversary for J.B. Hunt Transport Services to me is, is such a milestone and such a beginning in, in both senses. It's a journey of, of development and evolution and innovation on a culture that made it okay to take risk. We've always had uh, an approach that would say, we're not afraid to fail. To really have big breakthroughs, you gotta think that way. Because if you're always worried about, well, what, that could go wrong, then you won't really push yourself uh, to have meaningful breakthroughs. Nothing was too big for Mr. Hunt. That mindset came into us as leaders early on, to think big for our customers, to think about what was possible that really started with Mr. Hunt. We've had some very financially challenging years, but uh, we've come through that. I go back and think about Ms. Hunt was talking about one time, uh, her and Mr. Hunt was talking about filing bankruptcy on a Friday. This was back in the 60s. And they talked about it at work, went home, come back on Monday, never talked about it again. It wasn't easy. There was a time when I saw him almost give up, but he didn't. When he said, I can't do it, I can't get any more, and the next thing you know, he got up and he made another call. He thought big and he had big ideas and he wanted to make sure we were always thinking about the next big thing and, and that has inspired me and he said you know one day all of the freight of, of the U.S. will go through this data center through this this computer and, and that was a long time ago but that's still the vision for our technology organization today. What Mr. Hunt did with Intermodal was nothing short of revolutionary. It went against the grain of every natural thought in transportation and he was willing to let the company evolve and change because it said it's okay to let go of something that you like and you think is good to get to something better. When we think about our mission, we really believe through our assets, our people, and our technology that we can create the most efficient transportation network in North America. We continue to change. We, we see the opportunities and we run hard and fast at them and, and make them big parts of the company. And so the question uh, is, what, you know, what is the next big opportunity? The 60th anniversary, I just look back and reflect uh, and see and think about Mr. and Ms. Hunt and their vision that they cast uh, of how they were going to make uh, wonderful uh, careers for a lot of folks, and, and they've really done that. We're just getting started. We have 60 more years to just do even better, and it's going to be exciting. It's going to be, it's going to be a lot of fun for, for everybody involved. I see all the trucks on the road, and I see the company as big as it is today, and I think, what would he say today if he could see all this? And you know what he'd say? He'd say, I knew it was going to happen because he always was the most optimistic person and he always thought big. He is looking down and he is smiling and he is again with me thanking you and he's saying, I knew you could do it and I knew it would get bigger and bigger and it will continue to because of the people.